Agma, it seems those four were drawn into the tower with you. Mm-hmm. Destiny seems to link us together. No doubt they'll get in our way. But whether we can stave them off with our firepower... I understand. Use Morden's weapons. If they use the Alator technology, we can operate them as we please. Yes, sir. Well, it's a fight against time for now. It sure is ironic that after a span of 300 million years, it all boils down to seconds. What happened? We haven't disappeared yet, have we? It would seem as much, so we still have a chance. Wasn't the room we were in the information gathering device? The Alator is probably just a control device. It's got to be here somewhere. And that's where we'll find Ogma. Well, that makes things simple. Let's get cracking and kick some ancient butt. You said it. Move him out. What's the deal, Fio? You'll be left behind. It's no good. It's just no good. We can't win. Theo, we're up against the mysterious ancients. They've got capabilities beyond our imagination. If they don't plant their seed of time, our history will never begin. They're like gods, aren't they? Listen, Theo. These clowns are no gods. No matter how advanced they are, they're just people. The mistakes they've made are proof of that. For starters, there's those eight billion year old underground ruins. They're the product of people who lived a separate history. How can the ruins of a history that was supposed to be erased still remain? Yeah, and that Alator thing. Isn't it weird that Ogma lost track of it and it was partially destroyed by tectonic shifts? Wouldn't superior beings have been able to foresee and avoid stuff like that? What are you getting at? Maybe while they were repeating the same experiment over and over again, there's been a tear in the space-time continuum. And Ogma, in a situation that Ogma and the others couldn't have foreseen, has begun to happen. That's the weak point of the ancients. You got it. So, if we know their vulnerabilities, what's our plan? Believe in your own strength and never give up. And no matter what the circumstances, we act with cool judgment. And we always come out of things alive. That's it then. The same plan as ever. Same as always. What? You mean this is the same as always? <laughs> <laughs> well then, let's do this. Let's do it as we always do, Major. Okay, let's move out.
machine gun.
Look back down, fireball, grenade. Heavy machine gun, sniper rifle, double machine gun. Target confirmed.
machine gun. Let's shotgun. Heading machine gun. Double and enemy 
Shotgun! Strange shot! Shotgun! Machine gun. And an enemy trooper pocket range. Shotgun. Laser gun. Heavy machine gun. Machine gun, sniper rifle, double machine gun. And an super grenade. Sniper launcher. Flame shot. Shotgun, laser gun, heavy machine gun. Lizard, enemy chaser, super grenade. Not a flame shot. Let's 
Range Shotgun. Super grenade. Laser gun. Heavy double machine gun. Laser laser. Heavy chaser. Super grenade. Machine gun. No, it just can't be. Enemy super grenade. This one's not moving. This one's not moving. This one's not moving. On flame shotgun. Laser gun. Heavy machine gun. Laser shot. Flame shot. Shotgun. Laser gun. Heavy laser shotgun. Flame shot. In my two enemy chase. Pilotless double machine gun. Marco here. We're in the enemy complex now. Judging from the inside of the structure, we're in some kind of tower. Do you copy? Yes, I copy that. It's a tower that just appeared at a point in the South Pole. A point in the South Pole? Were we transported that far? And I just heard a similar tower appeared simultaneously in the North Pole. Major, just what is going on? I'll spare the details until later. We don't have time for that now. 
We're about to go onto the roof of the tower. Deploy a slug there, will you? Yes, sir. It appears that the loo of the North Pole has been activated, too. Yes. Our Lugus device is synchronized with it. Do not neglect observation of the loo. The Alator operating loo has already been destroyed. It's going amok. Yes, sir. We must hurry. That device has the instinct to gather all forms of information. The device running amok will be heading for the place in the world in which the most information is concentrated. You're great! This. This is the very core of the information gathering device, Lucas. The form that's absorbed 300 million years of history and wealth. Are you telling me that you tried to erase our history for a thing like this? You were bound to destroy yourselves anyway. Why do you lament so? Bound to destroy ourselves? But then so are you, aren't you? Hmm. We're the beings born from the seeds you planted, not your descendants. So you ancients destroyed yourselves long before we ever did. Am I wrong? You do have a point there. We at the Dino, 290 million years ago, 10 million years from the time we lived, subsequently became extinct. We became aware of this the first time we used Lucas, the observer of history that transcends time. How could that be? With a civilization like you had? No matter what civilization you create, or what glory it attains, one day the seed will die. The reason for death is simple. As a race, we self-destruct when we reach our final stage of evolution. Our lifespan becomes exhausted. But we are not bound to the same fate. To live and continue existing is the mission of those given life. That's why we began this research. We planted the seeds of history and observed the evolution of history with our information gathering device. We plant, we awoke after a long sleep at history's end to bring the device back to our age. We repeated this process to reveal the mystery of evolution. Again and again and again. But the results were always the same. Hold on there. If you say you destroy yourselves through too much evolution, why don't you just stop the process of evolution? If you say you just You fool. How can you call it life if there is no evolution? Existence now as it was billions of years ago? You're no better than a rock. We desire eternal evolution. Limitless growth never leading to destruction. We desire for that. I'll not hesitate to erase a hundred or two hundred lines of history. For That's quite a pretext, but as you may have guessed, we're not going to let ourselves be erased so obediently. Yeah, you're not the boss of us. We don't want to be destroyed either, you know. Agma, 
You said the mission of life is to go on living. On that point, I agree. That's why we plan to live. By defeating you! You still refuse to become the cornerstone of our future? And in doing so, have selected a painful death by refusing a relation? Then so be it. No, you are but a powerless seed, doomed to your own destruction while you suffer your own deaths. Lugus, let your final record be that of these fools' deaths.
Could it be? Lugus? Lugus has been absorbed by the Lu? Agma, not only have we lost the historical data, we can no longer go back. It looks like our only option is to seize control of the Lu. The information should still remain here inside. Get anyone who can move and get them to the roof. I'm placing everything under the control of the Lu. What about those four meddlers? Let them be. They can't do anything. Hey, what's this then? Just what's going on? It looks like there was still another device lying around. Did it swallow up the first one? A division among the ranks, is it? It looks like the one that came later is running amok. This is no time for cool analysis. We better beat it. No, we don't know what'll happen if we leave it like this. We have to destroy it. Aw oh, man, I knew you'd say that. It's tough being the hero. What are you going to do? This one looks much tougher than the other one. But the odds are surely with us. Why? Because we've got the skill, the experience, and the luck to do it. Aikawa here. Please respond. Is everyone all right? Marco here. We're all operational. It seems like we've been sucked into the belly of the beast. So the inside's hollow, is it? You got it. Wait a while outside for us. We're gonna bring this sucker down and fly out of here. Got it. Beginning enforced deployment of the slug now. Use it well. Hold on. Enforced deployment? No, Rumi, don't be insane. Here I come. Woo! Aikawa, do you read me? Aikawa! Look!
We did it! Take that, suckers! The dome is beginning to crumble! Fall back! Fall back? Where are we gonna escape to on top of this tower? It seems like the whole tower is beginning to go! It looks like our luck's run out. I don't think so. The goddess of luck herself is here! And a mighty brave goddess at that. Let's go, guys! Get up, quick! What are you waiting for, Major? Get going! Don't give up. It's not over yet. I know I can control this thing. Agma, let's go! Get yourself and your pals onto the helicopter now! Major! Quiet! Don't try to stop us. We've got to bring this back. We can't let the Tuatha Di Danann die out. Agma, do you really want to die? You can't stop the collapse! You morons! Do you still not realize the true meaning of life? Eternal evolution! Limitless growth! I've devoted my life to these beliefs! You're the idiot! How can you boast of life if you don't value your own? Come with us now! Never. Agma! You're pushing the limit, Corporal! Get Major Rossi onto the helicopter! Let's get going! Live, Agma! Live!
You're great. You're great. Hey, you're... I knew it. Our race cannot escape its fated annihilation. But you may be able to find a solution. Wait! I bequeath this to you. The life of the Tuatha de Danan. Those who are to go on living should inherit this. Hey! 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 